talk to Andrea Hurley, and we just talked to Dan Hurley, the men's head coach, her husband. Joe Zone is alive at NRG Stadium, about 20 minutes south of me. That is where the game will be Saturday night, tip off at 849. Joe, what did coach have to say? First of all, Aaron, what just great interview and great access to sit down one-on-one -on -one with Dan Hurley's wife. Because, you know, we get the coach, we get the players, and it's, you know, it's in this controlled environment. They're up on the podium, and someone points to you, your turn to ask a question. It's hard to get that intimate one-on-one -on -one conversation. But I will say this, um, as we're reporting now in a much more quiet environment, an hour ago, if you were with me, this was bustling with, with media people and players and coaches going back and forth. Well, we're in shutdown mode now. Dan Hurley was the last person to speak. Just about 15 minutes ago, he left the podium. But we talk a lot about, you know, the players and they're going to the first Final Four and they're nervous and they're excited and can they have fun? Can they have too much fun? Well, you know, it's the same thing for a first-time head coach like Dan Hurley. And he talked about that, his mentors. And then later in this soundbite about the two big coaches up at UConn, of course, Jim Calhoun and Gino. I mean, all of my great mentors tried to get me ready for this, Coach Calhoun and, and, uh, and Gino and, and um, uh, Tom Izzo and, and, you know, Coach K and, and, uh, and Jay Wright. Like, I was smart enough to try to get some the great advice from people of what to expect. You don't expect the, the, a lot of the media demands um, and just the feeling of exhilaration and, and just how big this is. Him and Gino are... You know, they are UConn basketball, um, so just to have those two guys around, obviously it's hard for me to meet with them together, <laughs> but I get a lot of time with them separately. I hope to get a picture with the both of them. <laughs> yeah, we'd all like to have that picture if you know a little about the history. They sort of would be going their separate ways on campus and at events like this. I'm told that Coach Calhoun is coming down here. He'll be here for the championship game on Saturday night. Gino, just a little while ago, he's on location. Think about this. For him the last 14 years, he's been at his own Final Four, so this is kind of a big event for him, too. We're live here right now in Houston, Joe's own Channel 3, Eyewitness News. Mark Zinni, back to you.